here are some cool and easy t-shirt designs to try at home. Tie-dye is back in fashion and it's so easy to do. All you need to get started is a white t-shirt, some rubber bands and fabric spray. First, grab your t-shirt and twist it into a roll. Then wrap it with rubber bands, making sure they're nice and tight. Wet the t-shirt in water, pull it out, then go crazy with the fabric spray, making sure you rotate the shirt so you get colour on different exposed parts. When you finish spraying, let the t-shirt dry out. Once it's dry, remove the rubber bands and voila, unravel the shirt. There's your beautiful tonal design, making this tie-dye feel both minimal and modern. This stamp and spray design is perfect for weekends. You can make one yourself with fabric paint, masking tape, cardboard, a stand and some paintbrushes. Put some cardboard under the shirt first so your paint doesn't go through to the other side. Then get stamping, making sure you press firmly onto the fabric. To make it extra eye-catching, mark some lines with tape and then paint colours in between. A design like this will take you from the beach to a barbecue and everywhere in between. Now for the Sharpie tie-dye. Grab some coloured Sharpies, some shapes, cardboard and masking tape and get creative. Insert your cardboard into the shirt, create a triangle with a masking tape, trace shapes inside the border and colour with Sharpies. Once you've finished your design, grab your hand sanitizer and spray away. It'll create a cool tie-dye blur effect. No rubber bands required. Watercolour t-shirts are another clever riff on the tie-dye theme. All you need is paint, brushes, water, and of course a t-shirt. You want to start with a damp t-shirt and insert cardboard to prevent the colour bleeding. Dip the paintbrush into a glass of water and then into the watercolour paint and go ahead, pretend you're Monet. The heavier you press, the wider the circle will become. This dreamy design is perfect for working freehand. Want something more dramatic? You can use stencils for a more eye-catching design. Grab a stencil, masking tape and some fabric markers and don't forget the cardboard. Draw the outline and just colour in. It's really as simple as that. And of course, with all of these tees, don't forget to wash your new t-shirt separately. That's five creative ways to make a cool bespoke t-shirt at home.